Good afternoon, Kim. I hope you're feeling better soon. I wanted to make this video for you so that you could see this beautiful villa. Um, just give you a quick run around of the street. It's so nice and clean. This is what you would see to the right. This is what you would see across the street. And this is what you would see if you went to the left out of your driveway. And that circles around, it's one big circle, this street. It's called Westbury Lakes. So obviously it's a villa, which means you share one wall. That's your neighborhood to the next of you. And this is the unit. So that's the two car garage front. And the landscaper was just here, so everything looks tip top. Um, you walk up the side driveway, or the side walkway, excuse me, this way. These plants are so pretty. They make me happy, their color. Okay, and then here is your front screen porch. So you walk in here, front door is to the left. We have a little table there and some cute metal artwork that looks into the guest bedroom. There's a bench here, and then to the right is your people door to the garage. Open that up. Nice big two-car garage. There's a little bit of shelving here, which is like the deep, heavy shelving, which is super nice. Room for the trash cans, reinforced double garage door. There's more built-in shelving over there. Your air conditioner is up there nice and out of the way. Hot water heater. The guy left a couple ladders, which I thought was very nice. If you don't want them, we can get rid of them, of course, just like everything. Okay, so walking back out of the garage to walk into the villa. Um, plantation shutters on every window, and they also have them on the front door here, which I love. Nice open plan. My favorite thing about this entire villa is as soon as you walk in, I don't know if you can see that, but you can see right out to the lake that's behind and through the pool. It's just so happy. So the kitchen is to the left. Nice um, where you can put stools here and sit at the Eden bar. Double sink, double porcelain sink. They are for mica countertops. Um, plenty of cabinets, nice and tall. There's a little plant shelf up there too if you like to put decorations. Fridge, stove. Over here there's a little bit more um, very tall and deep cabinets here. Plantation shutter window out that overlooks the doorway where you walk in and then the walkway. And then here, sorry if I make you dizzy, I try not to go too fast. Nice big pantry right here which is fantastic. Okay, so then we will walk to the right from the kitchen. Hi! Uh, laundry room to the left. There is no shelf in here, which, no higher shelf in here, but if you wanted one, you could certainly add one. There is a low shelf, which is nice. The guest bathroom here, um, toilet, and this is a shower tub combo. So if you are a bath person, there is a bathtub. Do not fear. Okay, um, now we're gonna, sorry, moving too fast. This is the guest room in here. Really good size guest room. Room enough for twin beds with a nightstand between them and plenty of room on the side. So if you wanted to put something larger in here, that would not be a problem. Volume ceilings just make this place feel so big. Again, more plantation shutters here. Ceiling fan really kicks around the air, which is nice. Okay, back out into the main room. So the way that these, um, the owners have it set up it, from the previous tenant is they have the dining room in this little den, extra room, workout room, whatever you want it to be. I mean, you could make it into an extra bedroom if you want and maybe put a screen up or something if you needed that. Lots of functions in that room. It's good size, but no closet. Um, or you could move your table here, which a lot of people do that as well. Again, more plantation shutters in here. Just gives such a finished look. Um, the leather couch. I can't remember if you're furniture or no furniture. So there is a yellow, like nice buttery, soft lemon yellow kind of couch um, and chase lounge here. That's where the TV is. And then we will walk into the master here. So big po four poster bed and a huge dresser with a mirror here. Again, more of those beautiful views out to that sunny, happy lake out back. 
Um, there are two huge nightstands on either side of the bed, so this room is ample big too if you needed a larger bed. You could definitely fit it in here. Master bathroom um, with a double vanity, huge mirror, goes all the way to the ceiling. Um, in place if you wanted to stick a stool underneath there. Then there is this closet in here. This is the master closet um, and it's got a lot of built-ins, a lot of light and um, storage in here. And these doors open up and there is more storage here and a laundry chute here or purses or you know shoes whatever whatever you want in there there's hanging bars on both sides down low up high there's storage up high and there's an air conditioning vent in the closet which is genius 